Fool, let's run it. We've been on a tragedy for months. Why can't you agree with me for once? Maybe we can be on chill tonight. Maybe I can give you chills. We've been on a tragedy for months. Why can't you agree with me for once? Yeah, maybe we can be on chill tonight. Maybe I can give you chills. I'm getting mine like fine wine, measure the time. Hey, too, this is your Maya, and I am back with another video. So today, um, it's kind of a chill vibe for me. Um, I initially wanted to make a video, uh, like a organizational video or whatever, um, cause the new year has passed and not necessarily one of my resolutions, but one thing that I wanted to do for myself to get prepared for the new year was give my room a deep clean and um rearrange it and i had started an intro to it but i ended up just deleting it because i completely forgot about actually recording some footage for it so i am done now three days later because it i had to do it in sections because it, it took a while but um so i'm done now and I decided that I'm just going to make a video of me doing my vision board for 2023. So I did make one last year, but I wasn't really on YouTube last year. So um, I didn't record it. Me and my friend had made one. I was supposed to do it again with her um, this year with, an, with her and another friend. But I'm very impatient when it comes to stuff that I'm very excited for. So I always end up doing it without them. And I know they'd be ready to choke me out. But love you. So <laughs> I'm just going to do it. Plus I got like real life issues and stuff going on right now. So I don't know when I'm actually be able to have the time to sit down with them. So we can actually do it. And I really wanted to have it done. If not before the new year on New Year's Day. And we're already past both of those times. It's currently the second um it's let me see 9 50 in the evening and i have to go to work tomorrow so i'm trying to just set some goals for myself um ahead of time so i want to get this done immediately i'm sorry if i look a little crusty i just got out of the shower like listen girl was on full lax mode once I finish my room so I did finish my room I love the way it looked I'm a little tight a little I'm not gonna say cramped but I'm a little tight at the moment in my room just because my room is so small and it's not really too many ways that I can really rearrange it but I like the way it looks uh so far so yeah sorry if I'm talking too much sorry if I'm ranting but yeah, so the goal for today is to do my vision board. So probably, okay, sorry, I had to make sure that my address wasn't on it, but they didn't get delivered to my house, so there was no point to that. But anyway, um, prior to getting ready to do this, um, I sent my pictures to my local Walgreens and I picked them up same day. So I already have my pictures planned out, printed out. Um, I have my board right here, right next to me. I decided to go with the, a foam board, more stiffer board this year because last year I did it on one of them flexible poster boards and she got beat up. <laughs> like bad. Sis is ate up. This is a, this is a piece of sis. This was like a goal that I had um, last year, pretty much. And I really love this picture. Whoever worked this is, you ate that, okay? But last year I had a goal of perfecting my craft with hair. Now, that's not something that I want to make into an income source. I can't see myself doing hair long term, to be honest. I already take forever to do my own head. And don't nobody want to be sitting there for five or six probably seven hours to get their hair done when it's something so simple and easy even with medium knotless it still takes me a hot minute um just because i'd be like mad distracted and then i always have to separate hair because although i have a hair rack it's very small it's not like one of them jumbo ones so i always end up having to like go back to re-up the rack 
to do hair so it takes too long so that's not necessarily going to be a goal for me this year but it was a goal last year just because I wanted to perfect it a little bit at least for myself which I still do my own hair um I have like one person my stylist who does my hair um I love the way she does braids her work is very good um uh, we have been venturing into wigs and stuff and I'm her brand ambassador so we've been trying to figure out some new cute hairstyles because I still got to kind of keep it military PG because I can't really have like two crazy hairstyles, crazy parts, crazy colors. So, you know, you gotta got to make it work, but we're going to be coming through with the looks, okay? Stay tuned. Stay tuned. I might do a video uh, just trying to get like a little bit of behind the scenes of like me getting my hair done one day. It does something that you guys would want to see maybe i don't know i've been talking for like five minutes and i didn't even get started yet so i sincerely apologize but yes i got my pictures i got my poster board um i did go and pack pack pick up a whole new box of permanent markers different colors um because i wasn't really sure what color scheme i wanted to go with i love that they have a brown in here and gray because i feel like my aesthetic for 2023 is very neutral I don't know why, but probably for the last couple months, I've been falling in love with tans and browns and dark browns, mocha colors, uh, khaki, just like all shades of neutral tone colors. So um, that's kind of what my aesthetic is going to be. Um, I even changed my phone uh, wallpaper to a neutral tone aesthetic. So I don't really think I can do too much of a neutral tone aesthetic on my board because they just have brown. They don't have like a lighter shade of brown or anything close to it. So we'll probably just go with any random colors to be honest. But yeah, we got those. I got me a bowl of mint chocolate chip ice cream because I love ice cream and I was craving something sweet. So that's what it's going to be for today. Um, I do have some tape that I'm going to use to post the pictures down. Because I used glue the last time to do these. Now, I don't know if it was because it was... I'm sorry. I don't know if it was because it was like a, a flexible poster board or not. But the pictures like raised up. They got like mad wrinkly. And I don't want that to happen again. So, I'm just going to tape them down flat and we'll see how it goes so i'm probably just gonna time lapse myself uh actually placing the pictures where i want them cutting them down to size if cutting them down to size if need be and decorating it because i'm not trying to make this a long process so without further ado enjoy my um thing oh i do want to show you the, the pictures real quick just real quick actually i'm not going to show them yet i'm going to show you them when the board is done okay so enjoy <laughs> bye <laughs>
2023 I wanted it to be a little bit artsy just to show my little mm, sorry a little bit of my creative side or whatever so this is my vision board it's kind of flipped backwards but I'll put a um a clip of it looking the correct way but then again, this video might end up flipped, so you might see it the correct way. But anyway, so this is my overall theme of my vision board. Smack dab in the middle is mindset is everything. Um, this sticks with me because I hear this a lot. And a lot of people say, watch what you say, because what you put out into the world is what you receive. So if I'm thinking negative and I'm speaking negative... I'm most likely going to have a negative outcome. So it starts with my mindset, getting my mindset in a different uh, thought process and a different mindset just to build, um, get down for a Um, 
just to, you know, get it together, fix it up. Next, um, just to do like a quick overview because I don't know when this is going to cut out on me. Um, I have a fitness goal. I don't want to look exactly like her, but I want to tighten up because I am in the military. So I do have to stay under a certain weight. So my goal weight is 140 or below or lower. So fingers crossed, hopefully. I got until April when I do my fitness test and I do the next height and weight. Gotta lock it up, lock it up, lock it up. Uh, first apartment, this is a big goal of mine. I wanna have this out by my birthday, which is in July. So hopefully, hopefully, um, first car, I uh, plan on getting a, you know, income tax home. <laughs> so I'm definitely excited because I already have my license. So I just need a whip. You hear me? <laughs> okay. Um, I put money just because although I work every day, I want to have multiple streams of income. So I have, you know, other stuff that I'm thinking about putting out into the world. Um, make peace with your broken pieces. Um, and above it, I wrote self-love just to remind myself to love yourself. Um, don't be so hard on yourself. Celebrate your accomplishments and so much more pertaining to oneself. Um, I have these two pictures of nails. This is actually my explore page. I just screenshotted it. It has like a bunch of different nail sets that people have done. And then this is a press on nail business. Uh, I just Google press on nail business pictures and that's what popped up. So I don't know who this uh, business actually is, but you know, um, I put this here because I am thinking about starting my own press on nail business. I have practiced so far. Um, I have um, made a few sets so far. I can actually include a couple um, boomerangs that I've that I've made well I can include a couple boomerang boomerangs that I've made of sets that I have already created um this is just trial and error for me I've been watching a lot of videos the research I've already gotten a lot of the materials and stuff now it's just me putting my best foot forward to actually maintain and be consistent with it um we have some daily affirmations here I'm trying to get more into um the daily affirmation world and just putting out into the world exactly what it is that I want manifesting everything that I want and so much more um up here it says learning how to learn is life's most important skill you'll never get anywhere if you feel as though you know everything everything is a life lesson whether it's a small lesson or it's a really big lesson whether it hit you hard or it had no impact at all you always have to learn something new you'll never know everything because the world is evolving every day and with technology advancing the way it is babe the mind goes everywhere everywhere like there's no one thing that you will always know about you'll know some stuff maybe most stuff but you'll never know everything so be willing to learn listen sometimes that's what my mom say um and then i put a logo of YouTube and a um, picture of content just because I want to have well it says consistency above it as well and then below this one it says you can do it I want to be more consistent with my YouTube con my uh, camera said I was no starts so I'm recording this on um, what is it snapchat anyway which I'm not gonna have a lot of time with this either but I put these two up there just because I want to get more consistent with posting um, YouTube content just to see if I can actually make it into another stream of income because I don't mind, you know, posting videos is just more so finding what I can post about because I really don't do anything. I have no life for referral other than work and military, so don't really have much to post about either one of those, but I did put those up there just because I want to try to get more consistent and I want to see if I could push the barrier with this to get myself more out there and um, stick to actually something. Okay, and then the last thing, because I'm pretty sure touched base on everything. Um, the last thing that I have here is a coat. Not too much on my tape sticking up. But last thing I have here uh, is a collage that I took a screenshot of off of Instagram. Hold on, because I got a camera right here. I'm not trying to burn my burn my room down but 
Yeah, so within the collage, it says things I'm manifesting for us next year, a job slash career, healthy relationship, the car you always wanted, and a luxury apartment. So that kind of just ties my whole uh, vision board together because that those are pretty much everything that I want, like, in a nutshell, literally everything that I'm looking for, minus the relationship, but, you know, to each his own. It'll come in its own time. But um, that's kind of like on the back burner for me, but, you know. Not too much, not too much. Not too much. You want my business? Don't do that. But yeah, um, sorry I had to like rush through everything. It's just like I was running out of time because I don't really have a lot of storage on my phone and I really wanted to get the bulk of everything and actually explain it. Um if you want me to do a video like a little bit more in detail of my vision board, going through everything. Um, I feel like I kind of explained it good enough, but if you really want me to go in depth about why I selected these specifically, then I can do a separate video on that. That's fine. Um, but last but not least, one that I didn't um, get to yet, it is a quote um, or I guess excerpt from a book that I actually have, Milk and Honey. If I feel like a lot of you may know it, but it says, if the hurt comes, so will the happiness. Be patient. That stuck with me because we all have our tough times. We all have our hard days. You got to stick with it. Thug it out. <laughs> Sometimes you just got to do what you got to do. Like, you just got to thug that shit out. And listen, better days are going to come. You don't always stay down for long. So you just got to have a mindset like, listen, I'm down right now. It's hard right now. It's tough. You may want to quit. You may want to unalive yourself, KMS. But you will get through it. You will not stay down forever unless you're just a bummy. You don't want to pick your own self up. You want a handout. You want a silver spoon. You want something. Then you'll stay down forever because nothing comes for free. Everything comes with the price and you have to be consistent. You have to put the hard work and dedication into it. If you don't do it, you're not going to go anywhere. And that applies to me too. I had to tell myself the same thing. That's why I'm going hard this year with stuff that I need to do. And then another thing about the money thing is that I really need to save. That's a goal that I have for myself. Uh, I'm going to set a specific amount within a, a time frame, probably within a couple months. So, um, yeah, we'll get, well, I probably won't explain that because that's a personal goal that I have for myself. But this is my vision board for 2023 in its entirety. Um, I was going to show my last vision board, but... I probably won't. <laughs> um, I mean, it's over there in the chair, but I got to climb over my bed to get it. And that's a lot of work. I'm not doing that right now. But long story short, set goals for yourself. Stick to them and do what you got to do. Because for my last vision board that I created, I think I've only accomplished maybe one or two things off of there. One, for a fact, was getting my license. I knew for a fact that I want to get my license. And then I forgot... What else is on there? But I'm pretty sure I accomplished something else too. Probably the hair one, but. But yeah, you just got to stay consistent with everything that you want and actually put it out into the world, manifest it, but you also got to put in the work. Do what you got to do so you can be where you want to be. Okay. Well, that will be the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoy. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Sorry for the choppiness at the end. It's just, as I said, my phone was running out of storage and I had to start recording videos on freaking either TikTok or Snapchat. So, you know, they only have a time limit. Uh, certain ones have like a minute and then other have three. I just was on Snapchat recording the rest of this video, but I will be back with another one. I'm actually going to drop a video before this. Um... So I hope you guys enjoy the double post, but yeah, so, oh, embarrassing. That was embarrass, embarrassing, but don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I love you guys. Bye.